We all enjoy reading about kings and queens as royal stories fascinate our imagination. When it comes to royal stories, we tend to lean towards tales of royal romance over others. Royal love stories often spread like wildfire and become the subject of national gossip in no time. Everyone has an opinion, making these tales a public spectacle. The big question is, which recent love story has taken place in the world and which royals were involved? To answer these questions, we have compiled a list of modern royal love stories from around the world. So without further ado, let's start. At number 12, we have the love story of Prince Abdul Mateen and Anisha Roshna. Prince Mateen, the fourth son and tenth child of Sultan Hassan al bolkiah is sixth in line to the throne and currently serving as a major in the Royal Brunei Air Force. On the other hand, Ashania Roshna is not only a granddaughter of a royal advisor, but also an entrepreneur with her own fashion brand and tourism business. They first met in their childhood and have been friends since then. However, their relationship started when they realized that they had similar interests in fashion and experimental tourism. So after years of dating, they decided to tie the knot last year. Although they have reportedly been dating for a few years, their relationship has been private. Prince Mateen occasionally shared glimpses on social media, including an engagement portrait with Anisha. And the sweet part is, they didn't face any specific challenges in their relationship and calmly navigated their typical ups and downs. It's believed that the couple's easygoing behavior and the fact that they've come from similar social circles may have helped them maintain a smooth relationship. Their engagement was announced October 2023, marking the beginning of their journey into matrimony. Following their engagement, the royal wedding was a grand affair, spanning 10 days of celebration that began January 7th, 2024, attended by thousands of guests, including international royalty and political leaders. Next on the list, we have the beautiful love story of Sheikh Amara and Sheikh Mana. Sheikh Amara is the daughter of His Highness, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Vince Vice President and Prime Minister of the UAE, and the ruler of Dubai. On the other hand, Sheikh Amana is a billionaire recognized for his philanthropic work and has served a year in the UAE Armed Forces National Service. The couple first met in the United Arab Emirates during horse riding events. Their love story started as they both shared love of horses. Like Prince Abdul Mateen and Anisha Rashana, they also kept their relationship private. However, with the announcement of their engagement date, they made their relationship status public. The couple got engaged March 22, 2023, and the latter confirmed their engagement with a heartfelt post by Sheikh Amana's father. In an interview with Harper Bazaar's Arabia, Sheikh Amara addressed whether the couple faced any challenges in their relationship, emphasizing that these challenges are natural and can strengthen the bond between partners. This perspective suggests that Sheikh Amara and Sheikh Amana have faced challenges common in many relationships, but have used them as opportunities for growth and closeness. This lovely couple got married in April 2023. They celebrated their Alt Keith Bob in May 2023 and enjoyed a honeymoon in Mykonos. The royal couple also visited London and announced their pregnancy in October 2023. Next, we have the love story of the Crown Prince Hussein bin Abdul II and Princess Rajwa Al Hussein. Born in Amman, Crown Prince Hussein is the eldest son of King Abdul II and Queen Rania. Princess Rajwa Al Hussein was born in Ridya and is now a member of the Jordanian royal family. Interestingly, Crown Prince Hussein revealed that they first met through an old friend from school and he considers himself lucky to have met someone like Rajwa. After their initial meeting, their relationship started and blossomed leading to their formal engagement in August 2022 at Princess Rajwa's family home in Ridya, Saudi Arabia. The couple made their first public appearance together October 22nd, confirming their status set as an engaged couple. Also, Crown Prince Hussein has been vocal about his affection for Princess Rajwa on social media, sharing heartfelt messages and well wishes. However, the couple's union occurs against political tension between Jordan and Saudi Arabia. The marriage is seen as a potential step towards reconciliation between the two kingdoms, but it's unlikely to reconcile all differences. So the couple has had to navigate their relationship within the boundaries of royal expectations and public scrutiny. Despite these challenges, they overcame them. And as of June 1st, 2023, the couple's marriage ceremony took place at Tsar Palace in Oman, followed by a grand reception attended by approximately 1,700 guests including international royals and dignitaries. Coming in at number nine lies on the list the heartwarming story of Lady Amelia Spencer and Gret Mallet. Niece of the late Princess Diana, Lady Amelia Spencer is the daughter of Charles Spencer, the ninth Earl of Spencer, and his first wife, Victoria Aitken. 
On the other hand, Greg Mallet was born and raised in South America, where he played rugby and water polo during his youth. He's a nephew of the former South African national rugby coach Nick Mallet. The couple's love story began when Amelia was 17 and Greg was 19. Despite not attending the same school or university, they were introduced through mutual friends. Their relationship slowly grew over 14 years, and after 11 years of dating, Greg proposed to Amelia at the Cloud Wine and Guest Estate in Stellenbosch, South Africa, on July 22, 2020. This proposal was a dream come true for Spencer, Amelia's father, and their wedding fueled rumors of a family rift and the public scandal involving Greg's sister, Fiona Viota, has also affected the couple. Nevertheless, they overcame these challenges and tied the knot March 21st, 2023 at the Rock Manor House in the vineyards of South Africa's West Cape. After their romantic South African wedding, the newlyweds enjoy their honeymoon in the Maldives. At number 8, we got Princess Martha Louise of Norway as the eldest child of King Herod V and Queen Sanja. She's been involved in various commercial and philanthropic activities, including starting her own alternative therapy center, Astarte Education, in 2007. On the other hand, Durek is a self-proclaimed sixth-generation shaman who became aware of his abilities at age five. Their love story began when they were first introduced to each other by a mutual friend at a horse race estate in San Juan, California. This introduction led to the beginning of their relationship as the couple instantly felt a deep connection upon meeting. Dirk recalls the moment they met for the first time, stating that he had felt they had known each other before. Verit even claims they shared a past life in Egypt, where he was pharaoh and she was the queen. After all of these, their relationship became public in May 2019 and Princess Martha Louise announced it on social media. The couple's engagement was later announced in June 2022. However, the couple's relationship has been challenged by public controversy. Regardless of all of these, Princess Martha Louise and Dirk Vered have planned their wedding for August 31st, 2024, at the Union Hotel in Geringer, Norway. Next, we've got the love story of Tamara Falco, Marquesa of Grion, and Inigo Onivia. Tamara Falco was born in Madrid, Spain. She is a notable figure in Spanish high society and the daughter of the late Carlos Falco, the fifth Marquesa of Grignon and Isabel Pressler, a well-known Spanish-Filipino socialite. On the other hand, Inigo is a Spanish hospitality executive who's popular for his relationship with Tamara Falco. They first met at a mutual friend's party in November 2020, and after their initial meeting, their relationship blossomed quickly, and they are often seen sharing affectionate moments during their travels to various destinations such as Paris, Indonesia, and Prague. Their relationship peaked when Inigo proposed to Tamara with a 14,500 pound engagement ring, which she announced in a touching Instagram post accompanied by a Bible verse. However, their engagement was put on hold after a video surfaced showing Inigo kissing another woman at the Burning Man Festival. The scandal caused public outrage and personal heartbreak for Tamara. Following the backlash, Inigo publicly apologized for his actions and expressed his devastation, reaffirming his love for Tamara and calling her the woman of my life. Despite the turmoil, the couple reconciled and friends described their reunion as a Christmas miracle. Finally, July 8, 2023, Tamara Falco and Inigo tied the knot in a heartwarming Catholic ceremony at Elricon Palace, the ancestral home of the Falco family. Next on the list, we have Hugh Grosvenor, the Duke of Westminster, and Olivia Henzo. Hugh is a well-known British aristocrat and a business figure who holds the title the seventh Duke of Westminster. However, on the other hand, Olivia Henson is the granddaughter of Frederick Purvey, the second Marquis of Bristol, and is known to have attended the Marlborough College alongside Princess Eugene. They met through mutual friends in London, and their love story started when Hugh Grosvenor proposed to Olivia at his family's estate, Eaton Hall in Cheshire. The couple has been dating for two years, and then they became engaged April 2023. The announcement of their engagement was made public on April 23, 2023. Despite their high-profile nature, Hugh and Olivia are described as very private individuals. Only one casual engagement photograph of the couple has been released. Also, the couple's engagement and upcoming wedding have been met with delight from their families. However, excluding Prince Harry and Meghan Markle from the wedding guest list because of speculation and controversy, which has made the overall climate a bit dark. However, the wedding is set to take place June 7th, 2024, at Cheshire Cathedral, a venue with a long association with the Grosvenor family. 
The ceremony is expected to be attended by the British aristocracy and members of both families, with a distinguished guest list that includes King Charles, Queen Camilla, and the Prince and Princess of Wales. At number five, we have the love story of Prince Philippos and Nina Flor. Prince Philippos is the youngest son of King Constantine II of Greece and Queen Anne Marie of Denmark. After his family was exiled from Greece in 1967, he was raised in London and visited Greece for the first time in 1993. On the other hand, Nina is the daughter of a Swiss businessman, Thomas Floor, the founder of a private jet company, Vistajet, and Katharina Floor. While the exact date of their first encounter is unknown, the couple attended the royal wedding of Princess Eugene and Jack Brooksbank together in October 2018. His public appearance suggests that they were already in a relationship at the time, so we can only infer that the prince and Nina likely met before that appearance, possibly through social circles that interact due to their respective family statuses and connections with the European high society. However, it's known that the couple was engaged in the island of Ithaca in Greece during the early summer of 2020. The engagement announcement was made by King Constantine II and was widely reported including the beautiful setting of the proposal. Like any other couple, they faced several challenges during their journey together, but they overcame them. Prince Filippos and Nina Flor celebrated their wedding October 23, 2021 at the Metropolitan Cathedral of Athens, a significant event for the former Greek royal family. Next, we have the love story of Princess Beatrice and Eduardo Manzi. Prince Beatrice is the oldest daughter of Prince Andrew and Sarah Ferguson and the granddaughter of Queen Elizabeth II. Eduardo Mazzi is, on the other hand, a successful property developer born Alessandro Mazzi, a former British Olympian and an Italian nobleman, and Nikki Williams Ellis, MBE. And you should know the couple first met through a mutual friend and they began dating in the fall of 2018. They had known each other for years before they became romantically involved. The couple made their relationship publicly known when they attended their first royal wedding together in the spring of 2019, which marked the beginning of their journey into the spotlight. Their love story took a significant step forward when Eduardo proposed to Beatrice during a trip to Italy in September 2019, and their engagement was announced later that month. However, their relationship has been a journey marked by personal challenges and public scrutiny, as both Princess Beatrice and Eduardo have dyslexia, which presented challenges during their early education. Additionally, the pandemic forced Princess Beatrice and Eduardo to, to postpone their wedding, which was originally planned on a larger scale. They eventually opted for a small private ceremony in Windsor on July 17, 2020. The couple welcomed their first child, a daughter named Sienna Elizabeth, in September 2021. Next, we've got the love story of Prince Ludwig of Bavaria and Sophia Alexandra, Evan King. Prince Ludwig is the eldest son and third child of Prince Leopold and Princess Beatrix of Bavaria. On the other hand, Sophia Alexandra Evenkink was born in Singapore to a Dutch-Canadian family and holds dual Canadian-Dutch citizenship. She has an impressive academic and professional background, having worked in the United Nations. Although it's unknown where they first met, Prince Ludwig of Bavaria proposed to Sophia Alexandra with a ring in the summer of 2022 in Berkstead Garden, which is a town in the Bavarian Alps. The engagement was announced August 2022 by the office of the Bavarian Royal House. The couple got married then, May 20th, 2023, in a religious ceremony at the Tidian Church in Munich, Germany, followed by a reception at Nymphenburg Palace, hosted by Prince Ludwig's cousin, Duke Franz of Bavaria. However, during their wedding ceremony, an unexpected event occurred when Sophia fainted while reciting her vows. Thankfully, she was quickly attended and given water and glucose. Later, the ceremony continued without further incident. Despite the challenges they faced, their union is a testament to their strong bond and shared values. Next, we have Prince Alexandra of Luxembourg and Nicholas Bagoy. Princess Alexandra is the only daughter of the Grand Duke Henry and Grand Duchess Maria Theresa of Luxembourg. She is the fourth child in the family with four brothers and is currently sixth in line to the Luxembourg throne. On the other hand, Nicholas Bagoy is a French businessman with a business background involving creating social and cultural projects. However, the details surrounding the first meeting of Princess Alexandra and Nicholas are not publicly known, and the couple has also maintained privacy regarding their early stages of their romance. However, on November 7, 2022, Grand Ducal Court of Luxembourg announced their engagement, which took place in November 2021. One of the challenges the couple faced was following royal protocols while honoring their personal preferences. For instance, Princess Alexandra 
chose a sleek cream bridal suit instead of a traditional dress for her civil wedding to Nicholas. And on April 22nd, 2023, the couple tied the knot through a civil ceremony held at the town hall of Luxembourg City. A week later, on April 29, 2023, the couple exchanged vows again in a religious ceremony at the St. Tropine Church, Bromless Mimosa in France. And at number one, we got a love story of Prince Mako and Ki Kimura. Prince Mako was born into the Japanese royal family. She's the elder daughter of Crown Prince Akashino and Crown Princess Kiko. On the other hand, Ki is a commoner, born outside of Tokyo. Prince Mako of Japan and Keikamura's love story began when they first met as students at Tokyo's International Christian University in 2012. Princess Mako was attracted to Ki's bright smile and described him as sincere, hardworking, and having a big heart. Although they got engaged in 2013, they announced their intention to marry in 2017. In 2021, Princess Mako did the unthinkable and gave up her royal status to marry. She became the first woman in the Japanese royal history to refuse the customary $1.3 million dowry. Despite facing public backlash and criticism, including a financial scandal involving Kay's mother, they remained committed to each other. After delaying their wedding multiple times due to controversies and personal struggles, Princess Mako and Kate finally got married October 26, 2021 in Tokyo. Unlike traditional royal weddings, they registered their marriage instead of participating in elaborate ceremonious rituals. After marriage, they've moved to New York, where Key works as a lawyer at a law firm. And with this, we wrap up the video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you find our channel interesting, please then subscribe to it. Thank you.